So after the um, winning straight games for Fong and Huang, we turn our attention to men's singles. So both Toma Popov and Cho Jin Chen are former winners here in um, Saarbrück. And as you can see, all quarterfinal matches went in um, straight games. We had five seats left. In um, the quarterfinals, we started out with six as we lost Antonsen in the um, before the tournament and uh, Lee Si Jia as well. But now just two seats left here in um, the semi-finals in uh, four different nations. So most diverse discipline um, throughout uh, the five disciplines here. And uh, we're going to show you both these semi-finals in uh, men's single. Here comes Toma Junior Popov. Played a great match yesterday, defeating uh, Li Shifeng of uh, China. And his opponent, a uh, three-time former champion here, Zhou Qiantian, won three consecutive titles here in uh, 2012, 13, and 14. Very impressive by um, Cho, who this year finally, after a lot of quarterfinal misses, got his um, first World Championship medal as he won the bronze in uh, Tokyo. The first meeting ever between these two players. Toma Popov won the uh, coin toss and uh, elected to serve. And incidentally, it's the World Championship bronze medalist against the European Championship bronze medalist as um, Toma Popov won the bronze medal in uh, Madrid in April and he lost the semi final to Anas Antonsen. So, 24 years of uh, age, born in um, Sofia, capital of uh, Bulgaria, but um, representing France and living in France, living in uh, Fosumia on the uh, southern coast of France, together with uh, his uh, kid brother Christo, and um, a lot of other good players have a practice center down there. He's played 13 tournaments uh, this year, one win. That was the Orleans Super 100 and one semi-final so far. Is uh, what uh, he's reached to what Popov. Here's his road to the final. First uh, uh, three-game win against Mark Kajo and then a tough match against uh, Unka Long. And a uh, straight game win against Li Shifang yesterday. And, um, that's, um, that's a bigger win than I uh, would have expected by uh, Tomo Popov. Cho Jin Jin currently ranked fourth in the world, but um, has been two spots higher. Had um, the ranking been unfrozen now, he would have been fifth. Third on the World Tour final list, qualification list for race to Guangzhou. Um, HSBC BWF World Tour Finals and already qualified for um, the uh, tournament in December. He's also played uh, 13 tournaments this year and also has one win. That was the uh, home tournament, the Chinese Taipei Open. He's been uh, 
very clinical on his uh, road to uh, the semi-final. Very unlike him not to play at least a couple of three-game matches. Uh, but um, very convincing so far in um, yeah, his conditions where he knows how to play well. Sidney Garlas, our umpire. And um, the service judge is um, Natalie Willeke. She's on home soil. Rompa Gallas is from uh, New Zealand. If you saw the uh, World Championships in badminton, you might have seen that semi final. On my right. Survived four match points to come back and win that bronze medal. And on my left, Chu Chen Chen, Chinese Taipei. Chu Chen Chen to serve. Love all. Play. So the match between the two former winners here is underway. Toma Popov won it back in uh, 2020. One very special thing about uh, Popov is that he's perfect in finals in his career. 12 Two finals loves. contested, 12 finals won. Then it in. Toma Popov challenges, gold Challenged in. by uh, Toma Popov. Let's see what um, Hawkeye has to say about that. I think it looked good from uh, the country position here, but uh, it wasn't. Good challenge by uh, Direction Popo. out. Service over. One, two, play. That's a good shot. It's a tall man. Tall man, Popov. 196. Six four, foot four two. against the uh, Chols. Five foot 11, 180 centimeters high. Good backhand again. Played a lot of doubles. Five, two. Both as a junior and um, also as a senior player, together with his uh, brother, Crystal, here during the pandemic. Played two categories in uh, six, two. A lot of tournaments. Tournament Popov should be something that uh, sort of supports the uh, forearm strength. Service over. Three, six. Good shot. Totally stranded. Um, Pull there. Four, six. Good disguised cross by uh, Cho. Long. 
Popov playing Five, up against six. that little drifter is here in uh, Salad Halle in the first game. Chol playing with it. from Cho is overestimating the uh, drift when we saw the um, at least the mixed doubles it didn't seem that there was so much drift that he couldn't play the backcourt at all eight six Players lost first round last week in Nine, uh, French Open. Six. Popov looked to the uh, fellow countrymen of uh, Zhou Tianqian while two way in uh, three games. And uh, Zhou himself lost to uh, Li Chigiu from uh, Hong Kong in three games. Standing well in. to show the line six. judge where the problem was. Good pressure. My uh, chalk. Over. It's almost refrained Seven, from playing ten. the backcourt at all here in the, in the first game. Chuma Junior Pupov was uh, four, game, four points to the good here. 11 7. Port one, twenty seconds. Port one, twenty seconds. New shadow. Eleven seven. Play. So play has been resumed. Service over. Eight eleven. 
I wonder if um, that's the general adjustment that uh, Cho was trying to make to his uh, game to be more attacking. I think it could be. Nine, eleven. Which is always a good plan when you play with the drift. It's difficult to control. Play to the back court. Great attack and uh, Victoria Carl is liking what she's 11. seeing. There she is. Ten, eleven. So far, four straight points for Chong oh. after the uh, mid-game interval. Service over. 12-11. Were you looking at court there for Toma Popov? 13, 11. Well left. Fourteen, eleven. So three-point cushion re-established. <laughs> Service over. Twelve, fourteen. Fourteen. Uh, clever play by uh, Chol, 14, putting pressure. Oh, using the uh, diagonal and then uh, turning to my pop up back towards his backhand side again. Look at this. That lift there. And then just the block. It's going to be one of the issues, in my opinion, coming forward for Toma uh, Pop of the um, defensive uh, footwork. It's a tall, tall man. He's got to have the same strength and uh, agility as uh, Victor Axelson. That should be his goal. 14 0. Play. Excellent play by uh, Cho Chin Chen. Fifteen, fourteen. And for the first time since two nothing, Cho is uh, back in the lead here in uh, the first game.
Uh, that's a pity for Paul Paul. I like the way 16, he sort of responded 14. to the situation, trying to take more initiative. Oi, oi, oi. It's gone way wide. 17, 14. Standard in, misjudgment by Toma Popov. 18, 14. And he's now down 11, 3 since the mid game interval where Cho really uh, changed gear. <laughs> Sense that. Um, it definitely is possible 19, to put some pressure 18. on the uh, defense of uh, Toma Popov. That's a good shot. Service over. 15-19. Thank you. Oh, look, play. Find someone pop on there. Sixteen, nineteen. Oi. Service error. And that means game Service point over. opportunities to... Um, 20, game point 16. Cho Tianqian. Guessed it. Uh, he took a chance. Chuma Popov. He had to take a chance. And so the over. first one. 17, 20. By Cho. And that one's gone long. So, first game, game. to uh, Cho Chen Chen. First game, won by Chu Chen Chen, 21 17. Good comeback from uh, down 11 7 at the uh, mid game interval. Winning it uh, 21 17.
Port one, twenty seconds. Port one, twenty seconds. Touch. Yeah, it's one of the few times I wish I spoke Bulgarian. Which Toma and uh, his father speaks in between them, and uh, it seems like this. Quite a heated discussion going on. Uh, it's not the first time we've Second seen game. that. Second game. Love all. Play. Excellent play by uh, Joel. One. And things down. have become more difficult for um, for Toma, no doubt about it. But it's also uh, clear that um, he's got to go for the attack. And Victoria Kao is very active. Mm, supportive during the interval. To love. Three, love. First four points to uh, Chou Tianqian. And as I mentioned, I don't speak Bulgarian, but I have a feeling that the discussion was something that uh, Toma Senior Popov felt that uh, Junior should do when uh, and Junior tried to explain that it was not so easy. Maybe that's completely wrong, but uh, that was how it looked like Five, from body language. Love. to get to it, uh, Toma Popov. Six, but Cho is uh, playing well now, full of confidence. Just changed his mind there. Oh, landed in. Seven, love. Landed in. Well in. So. Service over. One. Eight. On the scoreboard here in the second game, you see now Toma Junior Popov. It's gone long. 
Two, eight. There's the mascot on high level Out. opening in the background. Service over. Nine, two. It's gone long. Ten, two. On the 11, double line two, and uh, in double interval. quick time, Joel has raised to uh, an 11 2 lead here in the second game and it's one game to the good. Fourth one, twenty seconds. Fourth one, twenty seconds. Eleven, two, play. So please be resumed. Oh, almost saved by uh, Joel, but uh, just Service wide of the sideline. Three, eleven. Service over. Well, three. Let's the picture. They sense some tensions between player and coach We're on the opposite side of the court here. And I just don't think there's any um, 13, three. tactical um, sort of um, brilliant advice that can help someone pop off here. I think overall, Joel is um, better in the defense, he's quicker in his feet. He's playing with good shot quality here now, so it's just about to uh, 14, three. pick up inspiration as to uh, what to work on in the future for Toma Popov to uh, be able to better capitalize on that big smash she's got. And there's some supporting skills that... Um, needed and that's what uh, Joe is uh, showing at the moment well, that's landed in that's perfect lift from uh, Toma Popov service over 4 14 here is Toma senior Sixteen, four. 
Good shot. Service over. Five sixteen. Service over. Seventeen five. It's landing in the swamp. Service over. So standing the easy task Six, of controlling 17. the length when he plays the diagonal. Toma Pulvov. That's an excellent example of the uh, defensive footwork Service there over. that uh, 18, needs to improve six. to uh, be able to challenge Cho in uh, the form he is at the moment. In this tournament, find it in, that's a good shot. Great recovery shot from uh, Toma Popov. Service over, 7-18. Play and the lucky net court Service by uh, Cho Chin Chen of Chinese Taipei. Service over eight nineteen. And uh, match points Service galore for uh, Cho Chin Chen. Match point eight. First one save. Service over. Nine twenty. Good shot. Steep. Quick. Reply there from uh, Toma Popov. 20. We're in um, what I normally call garbage time, where the match is decided. We have a chance to uh, make the scoreline a little bit more respectable. Have a good spring in this step um, in this tournament, uh, Cho Chin Chen. Maybe due to the fact that he hasn't played those three game matches that we've often seen him play. Game. So, fourth time of asking, and uh, Cho. Gets it done. Entering his uh, fourth final of the year. And also entering his uh, fourth final here in uh, Saarbrücken. Won by two changes in 21 won 17, the three previous 21 ones. 11. It was a um, convincing display today. Once he uh, caught fire after the uh, interval. There was no doubt about um, who was the better player since that 11-7 um, turning point in the first game.
Here is uh, the final rally. So athletic, um, Cho Chin Chin. And uh, thanking Tonga Popo for uh, a good match. We're going to see more of uh, this man tomorrow in the final. Later on, we're going to find his opponent in uh, that match. But here, confirmation of the score. Salon Halle. This is uh, how things unfolded in the uh, first four matches of uh, the day. And now we turn our attention to women's doubles. Teresa Jolly and Gayatri uh, Gobichan Polela up against uh, Benyapa and Nuntakan Amsad from Thailand. When we look